What can you say about Carl Lawson? Uh, you can say that he was one of the guys uh, who was possibly ready to unseat Robert Kimdichie in his class as the top player in the country. And you got to remember, Robert Kimdichie was that Jadavian Clowney type of name, just a, an amazing football prospect, huge, mobile, a guy that, that was one number one bell to bell. Uh, but Lawson was the guy I think challenged him the most. The, the only drawback, he's just not the tallest or longest guy in the world. Hasn't held him back at the high school level or the college level. Won't hold him back at the, at the NFL level. Injuries have been a bit of a question. But for us, we saw him at our first five-star challenge, and he was dominant. That's when he earned his fifth star. He destroyed everybody. Uh, he was just a force to be reckoned with. And from there, it just shot off. Everybody else started falling in love with him. You know, we saw him at the All-American Under, Under Armour game, um, you know, and he was outstanding there as well. A guy who could come off the edge so fast, he had tremendous bend around the edge so he could get under you. His pad level was outstanding. Use of his hands, he would shock you uh, with the arm extension or he would rip under, um, you know, swim over. He could do a lot of different things on the football field and he was as good against the run as he was as a pass rusher. So this kid had it all. That's why we had him ranked so high. That's why we predicted superstardom for him. You know, again, it's been in spurts. The injuries have hurt him, but now, you know, that he's healthy, he's showing everybody that he's a guy that's probably going to be in that range of the first round as a pass rusher. It's just there's so many good pass rushers in this particular draft. It's going to be interesting to see where Carl Lawson falls. But I remember him at our VTO and our first five-star and just being blown away with his ability. Okay. Ooh, ooh, what's up? Oh.